My name is Mr. Devanjo. I want to welcome you to this uh, wonderful video on uh, Mathematics Olympiad. So this video is as a result of a uh, uh, student that I requested for this video in order to equip or empower them to be able to sit or compete for uh, Mathematics Olympiad competition. So in this uh, channel, in my channel, you are going to have a playlist that will contain all the short, short video on the Mathematics Olympiad question. So if you want to uh, be able to solve past questions that have been asked on the Mathematics Olympiad, you can uh, just check the pl playlist of that or this uh, channel and you will see lots of uh, videos that will be made in future. So the first, first video you are going to make is this uh, uh, challenge question that you are going to see very soon on the screen. And uh, before I show you the question, if you have not subscribed to this channel, please click the subscribe button right now on the channel so that you will be notified whenever we post video on this channel. And as you do so, may the good Lord bless you. Now, let's, you will have seen the, uh, the question we want to solve on the uh by the top thumbnail the thumbnail of this uh video and then you will have asked yourself can i really solve this question so the question is challenging but uh, i want to tell you that it's very simple if you know what to do and uh, the question is is this question you are seeing on the screen right now we are having sword four flood sword seven Basically, if you look at it, you would think that uh, it does not have a solution. That uh, if you are very used to sword, you are very conversant with sword questions. You would think that it does not have solution. That uh, this should be the uh, there's nothing we can do to this sword again because this sword is an expression. So there's nothing we can do again. But there is something we can do again. This is one of the questions given to them in mathematics Olympiad. So and that is why I uh, made it uh, possible to discusses with my viewers and most really the student that want to write a mathematics olympiad competition let's jump to the question and see how we can solve it now let's assume look at this what you're having right now this uh what you're having right now is very similar to this question here look at the left hand side, that side here this is sort a plus sort b so uh it's very simple to it's similar to this question and uh, but i just wanted to want to use this one to express this so that uh, when you have this you know what to do now here you're having the whole sword is covering this a plus sword b it means this can be expressed in this format that uh, anytime i have something like this i can write it at a uh, sword open bracket a plus sword a square minus b over 2 plus sword uh, a minus uh, square root uh, sword a square minus b over 2 this one look like a difference of two squares now then this plus we are having at the middle here is this plus here so if you have u minus here technically this one become minus everything remain intact so i have sword open uh, sword a plus sort b don't forget that this sort here is covering both a plus sort b then in this case it's going to give us a big sort open bracket a plus sort a square minus b over 2 and you can see that the sort is covering everything here then the same thing is written here as well but this plus becomes minus here so if you are now if i now replace this one with the uh, numbers now and uh, which you, which is what we want really want to solve in the first place sorry uh this is the uh this this one i gave you now you are still having it here then if you now want to solve uh sod four plus sod seven which look like what you're having here so you can replace your a with four uh with four year plus square root of sod four square minus seven over two plus sod four minus sod four square minus seven over two as well which is as a result of what you are having here. I hope you understand that. So this we can now simplify further. Four square will give uh, four square will give us uh, sixteen. 
that may have 16 minus 7 here that give us uh, 9 sort 9 same thing you have in there 16 minus uh, 7 give us sort 9 here so if you continue the solving the question we have this next solution this one will give us 4 plus 16 minus 7 over 2 then 4 minus so 16 minus 7 over 2 as well everything is remaining third then if you solve it further 16 minus 7 will give us a, a 9 then we have sort 9 sort 9 will give us 3 here also you are having 16 minus 7 we go sort 9 sort 9 uh, sort 9 is also 3 so we have a sort of uh, 4 plus 3 over 2 plus sort of 4 minus 3 over 2 so what is uh, 4 plus 3 4 plus 3 will give us uh, 7 over 2 here then 4 minus 3 will give us uh, 1 over 2 so that means technically you'll be having sort 1 over 2 no 7 over 2 pardon me for that plus sort 1 over 2 so which is uh, when we simplify sort 4 plus sort 7 it gives us a uh, sort 7 over 2 plus sort 1 over 2 you can demonstrate this one you can press this one your calculator if you know how to press calculator and uh, it's going to give you like uh, 2.5 something if you also simplify the right hand side also with your calculator you're going to give out the same answer so that means when you simplify this sort 4 plus sort 7 it's going to give us sort 7 over 2 plus sort 1 over 2 so that's the solution to that question uh, this question given to them in mathematics olympiad with that they are to simplify so we are going to the next video you are going to see after this video is uh, uh, the same uh, this same question but the question is more bulky than this one it's, we are going to apply the same principle but it's more bulky than uh, uh, it involves more other terms than this one so I want you to stay tuned for that uh, video so that you can uh, check the video so so don't forget if you have not subscribed to this channel please subscribe right now by clicking the subscribe button and uh, I will see you in the next video on Mathematics Olympia. Thank you and God bless you.